I remember traveling a lot with Cliff. Most of the people who would say, you're from Cedar Hill, you, 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 work, with, uh, you work with Greg Patton and Cliff Shaw. As a young city councilman, I kind of felt special just hanging around with Cliff. He's a people's person. You know, he can talk to anybody. Invariably, everyone knew Cliff. He's very warm and he can bring people in. I would describe Cliff in one word as loyal. There's a lot I could add to it, but he is a loyal friend. What's interesting with, with Cliff, he came in at a time when the city was going, undergoing a lot of change. It was a contentious time right there, but I think uh, Clifford Shaw and some others calmed, cooled the temperature down. Cliff came in with a group of people and had some concerns and just didn't really know the city real well. But then Cliff started learning about the city, learning who our staff was, learning the priorities we had, and, and he really just bought in to the whole vision and, and creating the vision for the city. And that's one of the things Cliff was very involved in also. You know, when we were around, it was a small city trying to figure out what we wanted to be when we grew up, and he was there when it grew up. And we got a lot done around here in 25 years, working together. My years on council from 2004 to 2010, you know, I feel like was some of the golden age of Cedar Hill. We had a lot of changes and Cliff was at the forefront of each one. Cliff has been a, a super critical bridge. From the government center that we're in now to the community center, uh, you know, the sports and rec center. As well as uh, Valley Ridge Park. Anything that had to do with bringing the community together, providing a place for kids to play, was right up his alley. Uh, the city was going through unprecedented growth with Uptown Village, uh, and Cliff was there every step of the way. For this community kind of growing from small and rural and uh, you know, mostly white to this, this rich, multicultural community that uses that as a strength and something to be celebrated. No matter if it was a contract, uh, no matter if it was hiring practices, uh, or even appointments on the board, you know, he always spoke about um, diversity. That actually changed my lenses uh, as I move forward and, and make you know, tough decisions. Cliff was always able to find common ground, work together, and be a natural consensus builder. It's one of the reasons we got along so well. I think in large part that spirit of, of a willingness to work with others contributed to the growth that Cedar Hill experienced. We just talked about building relationships, loving people and building relationships. And, and then all the differences went away because Cliff always knows a lasting relationship is more important than uh, any issue because the issues come and go.